Uh, welcome to, to day 15. Today we're fishing. Day, day 15. Today we're fishing. Um. <laughs> yeah. Just, yeah. Just, 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 yeah. We've had it. my little buddies. Yeah. We've had a few. We've had a good, a good, a good few, a few videos, huh? Haven't we? A few of them are pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Like that one. That one. Whichever one that you guys see has the most views, that's the one we're proud of. Yep. Yeah, that's the one. Except the ball just gave. The Rivals 2 video that didn't even come out in November yet. Yeah. yeah. Whichever one has yeah. the most views that's... in November specifically is the one we're the most proud of. And October. Like yeah. Rivals 2. Like Rivals 2. <laughs> like, Rivals, like Rivals 2. I love Rivals 2. <laughs> I love Rivals 2. Um, man, man for the beat. I like our little matching, our little matching yeah. ghost rods that we have. Yeah, I really do it's appreciate. Pretty awesome. it. It's pretty awesome. It's, it's a shame. Oh wow, I caught one immediately. I should turn on the music. I I just have the music off in the game because I was like, yeah. Oh, I'll turn it off. But you know what? Freak it, I'll turn it on. Well, the music doesn't play constantly, so honestly, you might be better off turning it off so you can add music to this. Yeah. No, I. Yeah. And this is the episode where we get where we get deep and deep and, and existential with each other because it's late. Oh wow, that was a big fish. That's, yeah, that's a big salmon. I was, yeah, I was thinking about stuff at work, like today. I mean, like. I was telling you while we were playing Risk of Rain. I mean, I was thinking really about like what I what I want to do in the future. Like, like I've thought about it so much. Cause I mean, for college, I'm like, oh, I'll just go for film. Like originally it was music major, but then I was like, I don't want to be a music teacher, cause that's realistically all I can do. And so yeah. then I was like, I'll just go for film to hone my craft of that, cause I like it. Um, but. I mean, I don't know. I feel like over time, I've just uh, I've gotten to a point where I'm like, I don't know what I want to do. Just in life, and then yeah, when it when it comes to like content creation too, it's it's kind of like I just kind of do what I feel like in the moment. A lot of the time, like the whole November thing. I mean, I just did it because I was like, man, I want to see. Cause like, I mean, that was you, a tiny sim. Oh, you got a tiny scent. Why are you- are you just fishing on the ground? <laughs> my tiny salmon. Let me see- wait, dude, You're I got- I got a huge rainbow trout. Give me a second. Let me see your small little- ooh, that's a good one, actually. Tiny little salmon. I like it. Anyways, but yeah. What was I saying? I don't even know. Um... Something about... Yeah, with consecration. I don't know, I just do what I want. I feel like, uh, over time... Uh... I don't know, I just, I wanted to do November, because I just want to put stuff out, because God, this has been a very long year for me, it's been, there's a lot of bad stuff that happened, a lot, a lot of bad stuff, <laughs> and so, I was like, man, I just want to do something, so, yeah, that's fair. here we are, here we are, halfway through November, uh, yeah, yeah, I think it's fair, yeah, I feel like it's fair. Yeah, that's fair. What do, you, what do you think your end goal is, though? What do you think? What do you think your end goal is? Whether it's content creation or just like, just life, I guess. Oh, well, honestly, I just kind of like, I don't. I kind of want want to just like live comfortably. That's just kind of it. Like I don't, I don't feel a need to get like rich or anything. I I just want to be comfortable and enjoy doing what I what I want to. Yeah. Um, so, I value freedom more than, like, anything. Yeah. In terms of, like, at least, like, you know, financially. Um, I would like to have that freedom. To just, like, not worry about, like, bills or anything. That would be nice. That would be comfortable. But I also don't feel the need to get, like, overly rich and buy mansions and fucking... You know, oh, I'm gonna grind every super hard every single day, become like a fucking successful fucking philanthropist businessman or whatever. I do not give a shit. I just wanna, I just wanna live comfortably doing what I like doing, and I like coding, and I like programming, 
and I like talking dumb shit with friends, and you know I like making shit. Sometimes when I feel when I feel like I can make shit, I like making shit. Oh, you make it every day. In, in the oh, morning. I make uh, in the morning, specifically in the morning, right after I wake up, I make shit for two hours. It's like a little stew. Sometimes <laughs> it's like a little stew you make. <laughs> yeah, it's a little stew I make. Uh, I mean, no, I get that. It's you know that the uh, like forever soup, for forever <laughs> stew that's been going on in that one. Yes. In the, that one place that's that's like that's like my that's like my stomach i thought that was in a cartoon is that real uh, no it's real there's like this uh stew or soup that's been going for like i don't know how long i think it's like over 50 years probably i think that is insane i kind of want to eat some of it i would die immediately though no apparently it doesn't it doesn't get you sick because they add fresh ingredients all the time but it's like the same broth Oh yeah, I got there. <clears throat> it's kind of been the same. Uh, I mean, that's, I, feel, I feel like that's a respectable goal. I, I mean, for me, I feel like maybe I'm a little too much of a, an overachiever. Like, yeah, I want to live comfortably, and I feel like me being able to, uh, as of recording this, I'm gonna go to Austin for the first time ever. I'm gonna go on a plane for the first time, going to a concert for the first time. I'm going. To do stuff on my own for the first time ever in my 19 years of living oh my goodness and i feel, I feel like it's uh pretty exciting i, I want to be able to like yes live comfortably but i want to be a little more rich than you you know <laughs> like <laughs> like yeah that's fair i mean it's like i don't know i was thinking about it i was in the shower this morning and i was like man i think the dream is like be not even rich like you said like do I think like having a million dollars in the bank, you're not rich. You're not rich until you have like maybe five to ten mil in the bank. Because a million, it's like okay, let's think about house, the bills for the house, yeah. all that. It's, you're yeah. you're not rich at that point. You're rich once you have like five to ten mil. That's what I think. I want to have at least like five million by the time I'm like thirty, but that's probably not gonna happen. But you know, it's like a, I think it's it's like a goal, and like yeah. I think being able. I mean, for me, it sounds just like, I don't even know if this is, it sounds corny, but like, I really, really have always loved, like, as I've grown up, I've, I've watched, like, you know, like, Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, all these people. I've always liked yeah. when they do, like, charity streams and stuff, and they just go. I love that so much. I think it's so fun. And then, like, as of recent years, like, I've, like, I've seen Doug Doug, like, raising money for, like, you know, the Monterey Bay Aquarium. I think that's yeah. so cool. And like, you know, I, I don't know. I've always wanted to do like like a charity stream or something like just like a charity thing, just for whatever I think seems cool. Cause like I love yeah. seeing people. So I mean like, um, now this is Twitch streamer. What's her name? I forgot. One of them. She like runs this um, animal sanctuary. I thought that was really cool too. Oh uh, yeah, I know which one. You're talking I know. About. I forgot her name. I think uh, it was like Maya. Yes, yes. Mm. You're right. That's exactly. It. So I feel like. Like, I feel like another goal would just, like, be able to give back, whether it's, like, to, I guess, I guess my family or just, like, just in general. Yeah. yeah. I've, I've always wanted to do, to do stuff like that. And I know, like, mm. like, I mean, like, I, I love doing stuff, like, for school, like, going to, like, a shelter and, like, helping out animals. I think that's so fun. And, like, yeah. I don't know. I, I feel like doing stuff like that with monetary mm. uh, value and stuff involve like money i don't know i feel like it'd be like a fun thing like i mean i i think i've i don't know if i've told you but for like a goal once i was like yeah. i think i was like oh when i get to a thousand subscribers i want to do like a like a little special not even a special like a like a stream and just try to raise like i don't know like a hundred dollars that's it yeah i was like that'd be fun like just to get people involved and like do stuff because i don't know i feel like it'd be such a fun little thing and then like a hundred dollars and then i'll just match it so it's like we donate two hundred dollars woohoo yeah and speaking on like fulfillment yeah now that i'm thinking about it i think a lot of my personal fulfillment just generally be comes from being like a well i want to uh, no I'll, I'll give myself credit uh just comes from being like a good friend uh -huh. to people because uh you know i've had a lot of friends that like struggle yeah with a lot of shit mm -hmm. and then they'll be like and then 
I'm the first person that they come to for whatever reason that may be. Mm. And I feel like, you know, and just having that ability to, I guess, be socially aware enough, at least. Maybe that's not the right words, but like, no, I you, you know, mean. having that, yeah, to to do that for people, to be that for people is really fulfilling for me, personally. I mean, so. I mean, yeah, that's that's really good. I mean, I, <coughs> sorry, I really like that too. I mean, I, I think you're like a really good friend. Like if I'm like pretty mm -hmm. sad, I'll just text you or I like I'll text Joaquin. I'll text mm -hmm. the group chat in general. Yeah. So like, I, I mean, like I know you guys are there. I'll be like, oh, let's hop in a call and like sometimes i won't just talk about problems like i'll just be like oh this is just game because like yeah sometimes i don't know i feel like i i think as of recently uh mm. like this year specifically i've kind of been more reserved and it's not even because like i want to be i don't know yeah. I, I i feel like the stuff i had gone through this year just made me really reserved it was hard to talk mm. to people after certain mm. stuff happened and it was like I don't know, this is just weird. And like, yeah, I, I think like gaming with you guys and like just this, like talking to you guys about like random stuff, I, that really helped me through a lot of stuff. So I mean, like, I appreciate that. Yeah. So, yeah. Ooh, oh my God, you reached rank 10. I was about to say that. I was about to say, I just, I just reached rank 10. Oh, I reached rank 10. Yeah. But I mean, yeah. But yeah, that, that's where a majority of my personal fulfillment comes from. And then, like, a secondary to that is, like, making shit. Yeah. Because uh, I think uh, I don't really do it that much. I only do it whenever, like, I get the inspiration to. Which is very rarely. Yeah. But, like, I draw. I do art. I learned how to draw. Mm -hmm. Not super well. But yeah. it is something that I can do. I know how to code. I know how to program. I want to work on games and shit. Yeah. Oh, you know what? That this also ties into the end goal thing. Um, I want to also become. I want to become kind of like self-sustainable enough because, like, my my whole plan, right, with college is to get. Um, yeah. A computer science degree, so I can go into like software engineering, but not specifically because I want to do software engineering. It's just like. Oh, this will pay the bills pretty much, and it'll pay them pretty well. Yeah. Um, and it's something that I also like enjoy at yeah. the same time. Yeah. So I get that. But the the dream, the dream is to become like an indie game dev. I, I want to make games. I want I want to make experiences for people, and I I want them to like you know, I I just I just I just want to I just want to create like cool shit. That people will appreciate and enjoy. Yeah. I mean, I I totally agree. Not with like gaming, because like I mean, I mm -hmm. I personally cannot code. I suck at coding. We had the same coding. That's where I met. This is some. Lore. Oh my god. This is some. <laughs> this is some lore here. Yeah. This this is some lore. This is some lore. Yeah. I met I met Aiden in my. I met Mr. Selene Aiden in my coding mm -hmm. class junior year of high school. And then yeah. it was good. You want to tell the awesome story? Yeah, so um so at this point in time I was going through a lot of shit in my personal life and like I didn't I didn't really have any friends because I had been moving a lot. Um so I I I, I I've always kind of been the type of person to just like kinda of keep to myself, so I didn't I didn't have a lot of friends. Um and I just kinda of like did my own thing a lot of the time in high school. Um so I was, I was taking this coding class and like uh we had a mutual friend at the time yeah uh, I, miss him uh, so I, won't, much. I won't i won't name drop him here but we, we had a mutual friend at the time who i sat next to and for some reason no okay I, the reason he started talking to me is because he also <laughs> didn't really know how to code that well and yeah. he would he would ask me and i'd be like yeah okay here um because like you know i don't give a shit sure yeah um so and then travis i think he sat a ch like right next to him i just sat right next right to him. next to him uh, yeah on the other side yeah of him so like this mutual friend was like in the middle right so then one day this dude <laughs> this dude asks hey have you fingered anybody <laughs> yeah i do not know i <laughs> i do i do not know him at all 
I like his, I didn't even register that he was a person that existed until this very moment, right? And I'm just like, what? He's like, oh, this, you have, you have, you have big hands. That was a good one. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. I don't remember what I said after that. I'm assuming I just said no, or like just kind of like laughed. You were like no. <laughs> you were like, you're just like, no, no. You, were, you were like, uh, uh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> and then you like, and then you did like a little chuckle, and then Brandon was like, "What?" Well, oh, so I said his name. <laughs> <laughs> you just, you just name dropped him. Crazy. It, doesn't, it doesn't matter. I mean, like, it doesn't matter. It doesn't I guess. Matter. Brandon, we're only, we're only going off of first names. He, yeah, he wouldn't. He wouldn't. He wouldn't care. Yeah, I guess. Uh, I think he's asked me to do a video with me, anyways, and I just said, "Oh yeah, oh, sometime." Really? And then we just never did. <laughs> Dude, yeah. I miss I miss the little guy. I miss, I miss him guy. so much. I haven't texted him in a bit. I saw last time I saw him was Christmas. He posted a couple of things to his story, like a yeah, week I saw ago, that. I think. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I saw that. I I don't know. I'm gonna text him soon, but he's uh, still deployed, right? Yeah, he's still deployed. Okay. But uh, God, back. Yeah, that's basically what happened. Uh, more lore. I think. I think I've told you this too. He was originally so I had two coding classes that year, and one of them, the one I was not in the class with him, I was actually pretty good at. I was actually not bad at that one. And then the one we were in, because it was AP, we were in AP. The AP class, yeah. obviously, obviously, it's a little harder. It was it was AP Computer Science Principles. I think yeah. that's what it was. It was because right? it was principles, and it was weirder. And then the other one I had was just computer science, like it was just regular coding. So that one in my head, like it, it just made sense more. But yeah. in that class, he was in my class for like what a day, and I j and then you just switched out because your schedule you said was like what changing a lot. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. He was originally in that class. Oh, it was because it's because I had already taken that. It's yeah. because I had already taken that class, so, so. or I had already taken one of the other classes in my schedule, something like that. Yeah, and um, I had to get a change. But this was before so I, I ever talked. Yeah. Like, this was before I ever talked to him. That's it. Mm -hmm. This is this is just I just remember him yeah. being there because our teacher, like, called out his name for roll call one time, and that's it. <laughs> and then and then yeah, that's basically that's basically it. That's basically what happened. It was a fun little story. And then we played Smash Bros. And we made this video yeah. about Ganondorf. And Garfield. And Garfield. And communism. And then Garfield's just been kind of a staple ever since. Yeah, pretty much. And, like, it, I, I'll be honest. My love for Garfield started out ironically. But no, now mine I just did, genuinely No, mine him. did also start out ironically. Like, I didn't... I'll be so for real. Like... I watched Garfield growing up, like the Garfield show, but I didn't care for yeah. it. Like, it, I wasn't like, oh yeah, let me, let me put on some Garfield. But that day, yeah. something like grew in my heart. Like my, my little Garfield, my little Garfield go, grew three, three yeah, times exactly. that day. My little Garfield, the space yeah. in my heart for him, it just grew enormously. <laughs> yeah. So, so yeah, I actually, I actually really love Garfield now. I agree. Garfield's wow. literally the the profile picture for my channel now. Yeah. And, sh and uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I I showed it I showed it to Travis the last time that he was here. I I have Garfield vintage Garfield pillowcases now. That is true. He does. Yeah, and I and I, and I low key I want to hang them up somewhere in my room. <laughs> so. Yeah, it's really good. It's so good. And also, by the way, I should say this. Shout out Julian Sanchez. Uh, he, I'm pretty sure he's the one who made the Garfield RP. It's the, it's a, it's like a little, uh, it's fan art of like Super Mario RPG, but like the characters are Garfield, and so uh, the, the Garfield is like in the style of Super Mario RPG, and I just thought it was so cool. But like, if he ever asks, maybe if I, if I ever get big enough, and he's like, hey, can you change it? I'll be like, yes. Shout him out. <laughs> Shout out him though. He's such. It's such a good picture. Such good art. Oh, by the way, the uh, you know my profile picture on Instagram. Yeah. Like the, the little clay Garfield. I'm pretty sure that is the from the same person who did the cover art for Orbo's Odyssey. <laughs> oh, that's kind of awesome. <laughs> yeah. So that's really awesome. Back to uh, I guess fulfillment and stuff mm -hmm. like. 
Oh wait, I did say this like I'm not a person of like like video game design or anything, but like music, oh baby. I feel like that's where I kind of shine in some aspects. Yeah. Currently, I feel like I'm very much a jack of all trades, master of none kind of thing. I like agree. Yeah. Cuz it's like I have an ear for music, but I'm not like crazy about it. I'm not fantastic at it either. Yeah. But like I can make something if you ask me to. It just probably wouldn't be amazing. It would be mediocre. I mean, yeah, I get that. I art I'm not amazing at. Mm -hmm. I'm like okay at it. I can draw. Mm -hmm. Not not great at it. Same with coding. Yeah, I got you. So I feel like for me with music, I've gotten it, it makes me happy to see how much better I've gotten over the year. Cause in January I sucked, and then I made warm food, which was kind of yeah. pretty good. And then after that, I decided I don't care too much about shoegaze and stuff. I just kind of wanted to focus on more acoustic and trying to understand music. And so, I mean, the rest of the year, I just made acoustic songs, like, all sad acoustic songs. I mean, I, li I, li I do like them all, and I do think Honey Bee uh, is the... It's, it's a good... It's I think it is a good song. I do like it. it. I'm very proud of it, and I'm very happy, back to fulfillment again, that a lot of people really liked it, because... Uh, I mean, I upload all my stuff on YouTube and Spotify and SoundCloud, but like most of my listens will come from YouTube because I just make like random videos that kind of fit the vibe. And like, I don't know, it, make, it made me really happy. One night I was looking through the comments on Honeybee and a lot of like, I'm happy, I'm lucky that right now I don't get any like horrible hate comments, <laughs> but like <laughs> I, I can take criticism, but it makes me happy when I see people that like get it or like are like oh my god like like I love how this makes me feel or like like the I get I like the message a lot and stuff like that like that makes me really yeah. happy when people just like kind of get it or like just relate to it in any way because I mean like all I want to do with like music is just make something that like I don't I don't care about making the catchiest or anything I just want to make something that someone can listen to and they can feel something whether it's like it's all right or like i love this like i don't know yeah. like that's 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 my goal and i'm happy i've already gotten that even if it's like on a small scale but for me like my bow sleep channel does so much better than this channel because like i wouldn't even say it's my effort that i put in that channel i mean like yeah obviously i put effort into music but i think it's the way i Mm, not market it's the way i pers i'm perceived presented. on that yeah i'm presented on that channel because i'm very much more mysterious <laughs> uh <laughs> yeah it's much more mysterious i don't really talk in that channel yeah it's, you're kind of like nonchalant i am i mean like i don't really <laughs> i don't really show my face um yeah so i mean hmm. uh, i feel like the way i present myself people just kind of relate to it with like the camcorder vibes and like stuff like that or like just the free yeah. the, the free will but i'm very i mean like i i was very thankful that people just enjoyed it in general and like even some of my like i'm happy that some of my friends enjoyed it too because like that that made me happy especially when it's my friends whoever it was they're just like oh i really like this one like this is this is like a, this is your best one i'm like oh really thank you um I don't know. I got really emotional when I was reading some comments. I was just like, wow. Thank you. I don't know. Um, if I were to, like, like die tomorrow or something, I think I'd be pretty happy. Mm. With that, at least. With, with, with like, the music stuff. Because mm. people felt something. They enjoyed it. They let me know that they enjoy it. enjoyed it. That's all I really needed. Indeed. What'd you get? You know how tiny this little toad is. You can't even see him over the particle Dude, effects. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> that is crazy. Yeah, sorry, I was just thinking about that. I don't know. Yeah. Um. But but yeah. And like, I I haven't really told anybody this, but I have a notebook 
Right. Uh -huh. That I've been jotting down ideas for this game that I've had for years. Uh huh. And I have this little notebook that I I jot down my ideas for it. And yeah. Like how how I want to approach it. Like you know, like all this. So. Yeah. And uh, I I barely have told anybody about it. Um, mm -hmm. That's like my that's like my little baby. That's like my baby right there. So your your, your first <laughs> idea was to tell <laughs> whoever watches this. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Yeah, but. yeah. Whoever watches this, whoever watches this. No one, no. It's honestly. Well, I fair. mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying anything about it. That is to true. To be fair, I'm just saying it exists. I didn't, yeah, I didn't, I didn't even know you had a little <laughs> journal until right now. Yeah, yeah. So. I mean, that's cool. That's re that's really cool. Yeah, it's like stuff that I have planned for like narrative, like characters, like world and some like world building, like lore, like a bunch of shit. Lord. That's just in this little notebook. The lore. Yeah. Cause um without getting too much into what it is specifically, I have a lot of love for games like Souls and like Nier. And like it, just these games that have these really like kind of like depressing <laughs> like fucking what's it called like kind of like overbearing type of like world mm -hmm. or very very hostile world yeah where like everything is like basically like against you or whatever and uh so I and I like I I like incorporating that into a lot of my my uh, my stories and stuff, which uh, you know I have a few I, I've written a few things I yeah. don't have them like <laughs> yeah yeah I, I I don't have them anywhere but you know they're, I've they're I've, I've written they're somewhere uh, but you know I've I've written a lot of stuff and like uh, yeah you know. I, I just have a, a, like a inherent attraction to that type of thing. Yeah, I mean I could tell. Yeah, and uh, yeah, yeah, and it's probably as a result of like my own personal struggles, or whatever. Blah, 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 blah. But uh, yeah, I I mean I think that's cool. I the stories. I think I also kind of lean more into like very depressing stuff. Uh, like, <laughs> yeah. like I don't know. I just mm. think having I like having stories that I write be grounded into like not even realism, just more like mm. I like the characters to feel real in a very wacky world. Yeah, that's my favorite thing. Mm. I'm just like, oh yeah, like yeah. And while it's not depressing, Smiling Friends, Smiling Friends, that's why you like it so much. That is why I like Smiling <laughs> Friends so much, because it's just like real people, it's just like real conversations. <laughs> and it's like, uh, like whenever they were going to, to Salty's, I was like, yeah, that's, I'd do that, honestly. Yeah. I was like, yeah, that, I would do that. So. Yeah, I don't know. I just like characters to feel real. I think lore and stuff, I'm not too good at, but I'm good, I think, at characters, because I know people yeah um i i really like like uh like making an interesting world and like lore and like world building and stuff and yeah. like i feel like i can write pretty decent characters it's just uh you know i feel like i'm a bit stronger in terms of uh world building no i get that and um i have this like inherent thing which I'm not sure if it's good or bad, but with my characters, I can never make them perfect. Like, they can never be like this, like, they can never be Goku, you know, like, like where he just like wins everything. He has to, you know, he, he gets revived even if he dies, you know, they have to have some sort of thing wrong with them or something go horribly wrong, you know, something like that. I agree. Which, I mean, uh, yeah. Yeah. That's why I like because like, because like, like, um, what should I say? But uh, because uh, and I think you, I, I think you can, 
I haven't explained it to you, but Joaquin knows for sure. Like in, in my like D and D characters or whatever. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I've talked to him about like maybe I don't want my character to have a happy ending. Maybe I want him to be, to be miserable for the rest of his life. But uh, you know, oh my god! Wow, that's a big one. But uh, but <laughs> but like but like yeah. But I feel like simultaneously, like if I lean too hard into, or like if I do that too much, it just kind of feels like, well, maybe he has no wins. Maybe he's just like another Yuji up until like, you know, final arc. Spoilers, yeah. by the way. Spoiler. You know what? No, spoilers. <laughs> uh, nah, I won't say it. <laughs> Go to die! Sorry. Sorry. I had to say it. <laughs> Sorry. If anyone's this far into the video and they haven't finished JJK, yeah, that's insane. Fuck you specifically. Well, yeah, actually. <laughs> but uh, but yeah. Oh, I have so many rewards to claim. Oh yeah, and I don't think I've talked about this with you, but like my my friend, um, one of my friends has been like writing this story as well, and they'll like come to me with like ideas for it and what, what they want to do with their characters and they were like hey do you do you want to make like a little character for this and i was like yeah sure why not yeah and um you know and like over the years they they like we've kind of like made this little story and shit and like characters for it and like they want to somehow fulfill it at some point some way in the future whether that be through like games or animations or whatever uh because they are very uh very artistically inclined so yeah yeah that's pretty but cool. they mostly use it to draw big titties so oh okay no i mean make your money yeah. somehow honestly yeah honestly chase the bag i like chasing chase the, bag. the bag i like chasing the bag if i ever get to a point with music or content creation or anything that i'm just like comfortable trust me i'll be very thankful i don't think i could yeah. ever be one of those people that's like yeah, blah, blah, blah. I will say this, though. I'll, I will say yeah. this. I think I've worked <laughs> very hard for it. <laughs> yeah. I think I have. <laughs> and also, I will say... Oh, sorry. No, what are you going to say? Oh, I was just going to say, like, um, in regards to, like, specifically, like, making videos, I actually really like making videos. I've been making videos since I was, like, in elementary school, mm -hmm. to be honest. Most of those are deleted now for obvious reasons. Yeah. Or delisted or privated. Um, but I love making videos. It's just that I really suck at talking. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> at, at least if it's not to like another person, I suck at talking. I mean, I agree. It's I super hard. That's, that's why you're so. basically like, like half of the, the, the channel. Like, yeah. I don't think there's been a video without you since Pikmin. Pikmin 4. No, that's a lie. That's a lie, Hades. Hades, and Hades, sorry. So Hades is probably <laughs> the first one in a while. Yeah. But, like, like I, I think we just we just bounce well off each other. Yeah. And then I can edit, so it's like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, I don't think there's been a video without you. Besides Metal Gear as well. No, you were in Metal Gear. No, oh. right. No, yeah. Yeah, I, I was in Metal Gear. You were in Metal Gear. So, yeah, I think you've been in every video besides Pikmin 4 and Hades I'm serious uh, like, yeah. because on, when I met you is when I actually started grinding yeah cause like I didn't grind before that I didn't make videos as much as I did like I made the cooking yeah. videos but that was it and then when I met you I actually started grinding on like gaming cause I was yeah. like oh this is always what I've wanted to do so yeah, I mean like, if it ever, if it ever, if it ever works out, yeah, if it ever works out, I will forever be thankful, and I'm not gonna mm. ever obviously take all the money. You know, like half of the thing, something like. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so. If you say so. It's cemented in now. It's cemented, it's cemented in now. Cemented in now. 
if anything ever goes now. wrong, go back to this video, everybody, and just like <laughs> at me on Twitter or something about it. Like, yeah, times. If, if any, yeah, if anything ever goes wrong, if I make my little like twit longer or whatever, is that even a thing anymore? Whatever. Yeah. If I make my little thing, is like, oh yeah, I actually this guy fucking sucks, butthole. Go harass him. Yeah, you can harass and me. Out. Use the, yeah, and use this video as proof. Yeah, use this video as proof. Link this video like a billion times underneath. Whether if either one of us makes a mistake, if either one of us. Oh yeah, for, it, sure, for sure, for sure. Link it under. You're just assuming that I would, but uh, under either yeah, one yeah, of us. Yeah, yeah. And then, either one of us. And then link it, and then say you suck. Whichever one of us made the mistake, and then yeah. But like, don't say anything like super mean. Just say you suck. Fix what you did, and then we'll yeah. fix it. Yeah, and then we'll fix it. Unless, unless. Well, unless, unless, unless one of us is a pedophile. That's what I was gonna say. Yep. Yeah, unless one of us is a pedophile. Then I don't it, think, I, I don't think that's happening. But I, but you know, it's never it can never be ruled out of the equation. You know, I think it could. I don't think it's that hard to not. You know. <laughs> 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 I don't think. I don't think you need to think about it. I'm. I'm a hundred percent sure that won't happen. You know. <laughs> yeah. No, I yeah. mean, you already said you think. I mean, like. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think that. Pretty sure that cements some doubt. Whether about yourself yeah. or yeah, seeing I when I watched I after watching the Markiplier J Schlatt collab, which is still kind of crazy to me that that actually happened. Uh, yeah. Mister Mister J Schlatt himself, he said, uh, or was it Markiplier? He said a quote. He was like, "Patience, something, something, <laughs> something about patience paying off in the end." And like, <laughs> yeah, something like that. I forgot what he said. And you know what, I, yeah. uh, let's just assume that's what he said, patience is the greatest virtue, I don't know. Let me look up yeah. patience It was quote. a metaphor, yeah. he brought up this metaphor of putting, pushing this car up a hill. No, he's talking about Sisyphus. Yeah. 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 Jay Schlatt brought up the metaphor of pushing the car Oh yeah, the and then Markiplier brought yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mar Markiplier compared it to Sisyphus, yeah. Um, but yeah. Oh, okay, patience, have patience with all things, but first of all, with yourself. I don't think that's what he said, but something like that. Yeah, something, something like that. Something like that, and you know what? I agree with it. I mean, I feel like I've been patient, and I feel mm -hmm. like I'm not a big, but I'm not like a big believer in, like, I guess, destiny or religion or anything like that. I'm not, I don't really care about that, but yeah. like, you know, I feel like the day will come where like, mm -hmm. like I, I get my, I get my flowers. I feel like it would come and I mean like every day does, every day every day is good in some little way I do something that makes me happy some days I don't actually though but a lot of the days I do as of recent and I don't know I've been working on more music I love music so much I hope people continue to get it or like feel something no matter what uh, even with videos, even if they're like really bad, like the Baldur's Gate one. I <laughs> yeah, hope so. I hope so. Gate one yeah, that's so bad. Ass. That one did suck. I, I, it was so bad. I think that's one of the worst I've ever uploaded. Can I just take it down? Can I just. No. I, no. Principle I just, of nonstop November. Can I just take it down? Live. Can I take it down no. forever? Yeah. You're right. That it, there is a principle. I hope someday, if I'm ever like. Maybe I, post November. Maybe no, post -November. I can't do it. I can't. It's like a thing where it's like, maybe one day I'll be like so popular, and then like we'll look back on this. We'll be like, this is where it all started. Yeah. I'll never watch that one though. I won't even lie. I'll never watch that one again. I'll watch every other video again before I watch that one probably. Yeah. But yeah, with like video creation, I actually really do like making videos. I feel like I should make more of them. It's just that my laptop sucks fucking ass. That is true. <laughs> So I can't I can't really edit or anything, but um, yeah I don't think my ideas for edits are all that bad. I think I think they're a little silly, a little goofy, kind of like the oh my god you just killed yourself. Sorry. Um, like I I only have like two videos up on my channel right now, but um. I like that skeleton edit. Yeah, the <laughs> the skeleton edit. Yeah. Um, which one? Which one? The one with the closet in the Garfield video. Oh yeah, he was also in the toilet in the Garfield video. Oh, I, I'll be so for I forgot about that. Yeah, I put him in the toilet for like two seconds. But um, but yeah, like 
I don't know. I, I think I think editing is pretty fun. I like I like editing videos, and uh, I would like to make video more videos. It's just like uh, I don't I don't really have the space nor a lot of opportunities to make them currently. So, you know, maybe when I upgrade. Maybe yeah. When I upgrade. So. Yeah. That Valorant video is at two hundred video uh, two hundred views by the way. Dude. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's Valorant. Okay, but so we don't talk sense. about anything in that video. Exactly. Which kind of sucks, because if we actually had, like, good topics, I wouldn't even be that mad. But I know we yeah, didn't really no, talk. It's just... <laughs> <laughs> and it's actually just, like, fuck your ass. And you know what's crazy? Out of mm. 200 views, 9... 18% of people stayed until... 18 minutes crazy out of 200 people 18 percent they watched the whole i know the whole there's whole thing everyone nine percent of people have watched the whole 30 minute video which is kind of crazy to me because why would what they? is keeping their retention did we like get really funny in the second half i don't remember i don't think we did i don't think so either <laughs> I don't think we said anything funny. I agree. I'm glad the cookie clicker video is performing as well it is as it is. Though. Yeah, I'm also I'm pretty happy that one is. Yeah, because like I didn't I didn't expect it to at all. Neither of us expected expected it to at all. Yeah. So. Yeah. It was doing really well. So yeah, I mean. And uh, yeah. Anyways. At the, yeah. At the time of recording this, we don't know. But I hope the Double Dash video does very well as well. <laughs> I agree. I really do hope it does. <laughs> like, like I do. I doubt it will, cause it is just, it is just it's, so long. It is so long for, for a really good payoff. It has a really good payoff, but it is so long to get to it. I agree, but like some people like a slow burn. If they watch the dude, some people like One Piece. Some people do like One Piece, which is kind of still insane to me. Like. Like, okay, I, t I will always stand by the whole argument of, like, if I think a good storyteller could tell the story of One Piece in probably less than, like, let's say 200 episodes. Mm. I will always stand by that. Like, I, d I just think it's too long. And then they have all this filler, and, like, in the anime, like, it looks so bad. Like, I've seen even, like, One Piece fans, like, friends that I know that watch One Piece are like, yeah, it does get unbearable at times, but, like, it's peak, and I'm like, okay, well, <laughs> I believe you, I guess. I'll never watch it. So... I've seen up yeah, to episode 50. And, uh, I'm trying to remember where I was. I got farther than you, for sure. Yeah. I'm just trying to remember how far I got. Because I got to Logetown. <laughs> oh, that was... Yeah, that was, a. Uh, yeah, but, um, it's right before Chopper, right? Yes. I don't know. I, I I'll be honest. I don't remember because it's been so long. But um, the I know I finished Skypea, and I got a little bit mm. further. I don't. I think I think I got past Skypea, and then I've heard that name. And then I didn't get. I have I haven't gotten to the next major arc after Skype. I think that was it. I um yeah. But yeah, from what I watched I'll be honest, a lot of the One Piece filler, in my opinion, from what I have both watched myself and seen, uh -huh. a lot of the Filler is majority just from the intros and recaps. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like I don't, I don't think there's too much filler because I feel like most things come back later. Yeah, which also kind of sucks in a way because I know how slow it is. <laughs> God, because like because there's so little filler and it's so slow paced. Oh my god! Whoa. <laughs> oh my god, dude, it's covering my face. Yeah. Ah, oh, thanks. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. 
It's doing what? It's covering your... Yeah? That's fine. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> that is... Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm going to go in the cabinet. Cabin. Mm, should I increase my rod low? Nah, I forget. But yeah, um... Yeah. This camera, this camera. You know what, I feel like this is a good question to end it off, because I do need to go soon. Go ahead, what do you... What's your, what's your dream collab? What's your dream collab? No, with, with anything, just in general. Whether it's in like general. whether it's like you're gonna do a video doing a game, doing anything. Mm -hmm. Like collab I don't know. Mm -hmm. What is your dream collab? Ooh, okay. You can you can name like dream two collab. or three, I don't care. Oh, yeah. Dream collab for a game? Mm hmm Specifically. I I think I'd depending on what it what it is, right? Mm -hmm. I'd want to get somebody for the soundtrack, and depending on what it is, are, are you gonna say I think I Hideki did? Nagan oh. Hideki Naganuma would be really fun. Mm -hmm. I feel, um, fucking, I can't believe I forget his name. Guy who composed a lot of the Doom 2016 music. I don't know his name. I'll be so for him. Yeah, I can't. I can't believe I'm blanking on it. Him, um, and then my second little favorite white boy, Cloudy Sky. That's what I. Yeah, that's what I immediately assumed. Yeah. So we should get. We should get. A, I think we should get him to play a game with us. To be honest, do you think I could just wait? Do I follow him on Instagram? <laughs> do you? I don't think I, I do. I've been I've been following him. I follow I, I have his YouTube. I follow his YouTube. I might be. I think his. Uh... I don't follow him. I think on. Which album? I actually I don't comment on YouTube, but I did comment on one of his albums that he posted. I think I commented on what do you want specifically. I, I need to I need to look through his stuff, but um, yeah, because uh, I I really like his stuff. Um, so if anyone's watching this and they have a if they have a hookup, let us know. Let us know. Let us know. We'll do. We'll he does play. He, he does play web fishing. We'll play web fishing. We could. We'll too. we'll actually do a web fishing episode with him. And we'll do an interview. We should do that. We should. <laughs> no, stop. We're night Fridays, white fishing Wednesdays. We're night white fishing Wednesdays. M Among Smash us. Smash Bros. Saturdays. Smash Bros. Saturdays. Uh, Melee Mondays. Yeah. Ta and Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. It's just it's just, it's our day off. We just get to eat tacos. Yeah. Yeah. We just get to eat tacos. White fishing oh, Wednesday. What's your favorite? What's, what's your favorite taco? What's your favorite taco? Uh, it doesn't BD. have to be from anywhere specific, just like... My favorite taco to eat, like, it's Bidia tacos. Yeah. Ooh, you know, I, I need to I need to eat Bidia. Never I had it? Never, I've never had it. Oh, dude, it's like probably... Like, it tastes so good, but God, it makes you feel so fat. But that's how you know <laughs> it's good. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a big uh, fajita taco fan. Yeah, that's a good one. It's not bad. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Put some like onions and like mm -hmm. peppers inside. Some, some some avocado. What do you what do you think of a? Uh... Yeah. No, I don't even I don't even know what I was gonna say. Yeah. X is for peanuts. I... X is for what? <laughs> I think my dream collab. Uh man, if I were to think of it, what would be my dream collab? Okay, well I mean. I think one's obvious, but uh, yeah. for let's think for content creation, like if I were to do a YouTube video, I think a fun per. I mean, like I've been a big J Schlatt head since 2020, so I yeah. mean, like I feel like I feel like that's just an easy one. I feel like we, I feel like I do get a lot of inspiration for humor from him anyway, so I feel like it wouldn't be too hard to like match the bit energy. Yeah. Oh, I got a little glistening leech. Do you see this? I do. I do. I see him glistening. Yeah. Um. 
I feel like Jay Schlatt. I mean, another one. I mean, Markiplier. Just, oh my goodness. Yeah. I feel like that's just... <laughs> yeah. And then, like... It's like another person like I just love that's a YouTuber. My dream collab would have been Etika. That would have been my dream collab. Sorry. Yeah. That, that would have been my dream collab. That's... Who's another person? Jay Shalad, Markiplier. Because I'm thinking about who would... The most... Like, who would be, like, just the most fun to, like, make a video with? I don't think Markiplier would be the most fun. Because yeah, I think he's too chill. Yeah, I think, I mean, I, I guess, like, those two. Maybe, like, I would love to collab with Alfred. I think that's just... That's... It's been a dream. Yeah. It's been a dream forever. Yeah. For, for long-term viewers, you know. I'm a big <laughs> Alfred. You, you can tell. Especially early on. Yeah. God, I was such a big alpha red head. But yeah, I feel like those are the three. And then for music, oh my God! Don't let them, what? Don't let them know that alpha red gold is <laughs> what inspired us for not November. Don't, don't let tell them. them don't let them know. <laughs> don't let them know. Yeah, I mean, like, listen, mm -hmm. this uploading daily an alpha red plus platinum gold thing only is that really? a thing uploading did they come up with the idea of uploading daily no but they came up they they <laughs> did upload a uh they a did upload every single day they did do that for a year yeah and i kept year. up for a very long time <laughs> i think anyone can tell i'm a very big big alpha rat head oh hive mind oh my god i would love to collab oh. with hive mind so bad Oh my god, I love Hive Mind. Hive Mind is like, I'm like I, if I'm pooping or I'm like eating, Hive Mind is like what I'll pull up and I'll just watch Hive Mind. I think they're so funny. I think I think mm. they're so funny. Anyway, and then music, Kodeka. There's this um underrated artist that I, that I love. Her name's Olivia O. Oh. She does. I think she does great acoustic music. She inspired me a lot, especially for Honeybee. If you were to listen to any of her music, you'd be like, I see it. Um, I do. I, I love her music. I think she is one of the most underrated artists, and like, yeah. I I think her voice is just so amazing. Her instrumentation, her instrumentation, like her stuff, is like I think very stripped back, and some people won't enjoy it because, especially in her new album, she does like her raspy voice. I feel like it sounds like it's almost out of tune. It sounds like she's singing in the wrong key, but she's not. It's, just, it's a certain style. If you don't like it, then like it's whatever. Like I wouldn't blame anyone. Things, yeah. I love her. I love her music so much. Like I think she she's a very big inspiration for me. So I'd love to collab with her. <sighs> and then uh, who else? I think that's those are those are like my main two right now. Those are the two I like. I'd be like, yeah. oh yeah, I I made it. Yeah. I think. I think the Olivia collab is more believable out of out of all the people I named but yeah mm. I don't know I feel like uh, the goal for the Linguini channel uh, get to a thousand subs we do a charity stream that's the goal that's the goal by like someday mm -hmm. one day one day we'll do that yeah. one day let us know if you made it to the end of the video let us know if you did, let us know. If you did, let us know what games we should play. We already have our games picked out. I'm joking. <laughs> if but you yeah. made it to the end of the video, type. Type. If I've gone fishing. I've gone fishing. That's actually yeah. If you if you made it to the end of the video, type. If I've gone missing, I've gone fishing. And I feel like yeah. Do you have anything you want to say besides that? Um. Uh, cherish the people that you have now. Before they're gone. That's it. Before they're gone. Yeah. That's not even a joke. It's just one. You never yeah, know what. That's, that's yeah. just. You never that's know. Just real. One day. What would you do? Wait. Okay. Last a question. What if one of us died during nonstop November? Do you want to? Do you like? If you died, would you want me to f continue and like finish it off? Oh yeah, for sure. Because. Honestly, this was your idea. This was your thing. Um, I'm just along for the ride. So, 
I think I think you've been on I think you've been on long for the ride for like two years. So you know I feel like, <laughs> I feel like that's, that's fair. Yeah, I feel, I feel I think you get a say in it after after a certain point. Yeah, but uh, yeah, no, I, I want you to continue it. So because like I mean, ultimately, yeah, this is your thing. That is true. But, I I do do all the quote unquote editing and everything. Yeah, you have you're the one who has access to the t- channel. You're the one who does the editing. I'm just the guy who maybe says something funny every two videos. That's true. <laughs> this won't be the one. Next video, guys, get ready. It's Next gonna be good. Video. It's gonna be good. <laughs> tomorrow, you're gonna you're gonna be laughing. Hey, what's tomorrow? Oh, we don't even. I, know. I, 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 we don't. I, we don't, I don't. Yeah, we don't have anything don't for remember. the 16th. Wait, do we actually not? No, we don't. We have a question mark. <laughs> Why do we have a question mark for the 16th? Okay, actually, anyone who made it to this far into the video, please let us <laughs> know what to play tomorrow. Oh my god. I actually don't know what we should play. We can figure it out. Fuck. Yeah, well, we'll, we'll figure it out. Well, everybody, I hope you enjoyed uh, getting sticky and uh, th- thinking about life. Uh, cherish the people you love. Uh, do whatever you want to do with your life. Because you only live once. Uh, that's what they used to say back in 2013. YOLO. Uh, if you if you get invited to go to a party or to a concert or to anything, and you're like, I'm not feeling it tonight, just go, just do it, just do it. Cause you never know. Just do everything once, except heroin, cause then you'll get addicted. Thank you. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch it. And I I hope you have a good night. Good night.